Pandora friends, my name is Leanne and I am Mad for Pandora. Welcome back to another video. I hope you are doing well and staying safe. So as I said in the last video, I've just been to the Pandora store this week and they happen to have the new catalogues and I'm really excited to be able to show it to you. So this is a new catalogue and it actually has some previews of stuff that's not even available yet so that's really really exciting. So I can't wait to show it to you. I'll just zoom in and get started. Okay now we've zoomed in I will um, not too, take too much time on the things that have always been out. I will try and spend a little bit more time on the new things that I notice. I haven't spent a lot of time looking at this book so I might brush over a few things I'm not really sure. So these are just the regular bracelets Hopefully you can see the writing and the prices and things. Okay, this bracelet here is the new one. Well, it was came out last year. Now I hadn't had much chance to actually look at it, but I did do a order in the buy three get one get one free the other day, and I did manage to get this bracelet. Now it's actually very nice. Pop the book out of the way for a sec. Now I like that it's actually wanting to do an oval shape. It's really good for my arm and I like that the clasp is flat and sits flat. It reminds me very much of the two-tone version that's similar to this. It wasn't something I initially thought I would be getting but I've been looking for a bracelet without the clip stations that I could buy a size 17 because I really wanted to just basically get one of my charms like this one that I got last year for Valentine's Day there you go. it's a nice strong clasp too okay so that's my free hugs free kisses and when I have this on my arm I can wear the clasp up and have this dangling down my arm and because the bracelet's fairly firm it doesn't spin or anything and the dangle stays in place because it can't fit under there on my wrist to spin off the threads so I've been enjoying wearing it like that and I love how it's still really stiff because I love my bracelets like that anyway that's that new bracelet I haven't seen too many youtubers show that one so there's a rose version in that as well in the shine Now they've got the new version of this out. I saw that the other day in store. It's fairly expensive. But if you're after a two-tone bracelet, it's quite a good option. I do prefer the old style because the clasp is a bit larger. But I guess they think that it's the new modern design or something like that. OK, 
okay these are pretty much the same oh these are the ones that came out a little while ago I did buy one of these bracelets but because it's got the clip stations I found that going in the size 17 with this I really didn't like it I didn't think I was going to have the room for the clips and now I'm going I see other people's bracelets and I'm like oh maybe I should have kept it I'm not really sure but I'm fairly happy with the new one I got See, at least in the rose version it doesn't have the clip stations and this is a brand new bracelet I saw that in store the other day I got it in the rose as well it's actually quite nice I would have preferred the clip on it if they had a had the little loop like the essence bracelets had how you could sort of put it into a little channel I would have preferred that and then I would have been tempted to have got that bracelet but I thought you can't really I mean you could do a clip on safety chain or something like that but I sort of spoils the look of it so if they had have done the little link bit that sort of slots in it would have been a lot safer that bracelet but it is very beautiful Now this one's coming out in Mother's Day, I believe. Just check the dates. 15th of April in Australia. I guess that'll be in most places. I think because that's also the flat clasp design, I think I'll quite like that one. Not that I know that I'll be getting more. And this was originally limited time, but it's still out in Australia as well. It's really beautiful. I've got that one. That's a fairly new one too. This is the other T-bar bracelet that came out a little while back. I was going to get this one, but I ended up not getting it. I tried it on in store but I found the link bit because I like a firm bracelet the links were too long to make it really comfortable but it was the other version that I was thinking of getting just to wear the single dangle charm like this on it now this I'm really excited about See, I'd get this in a size 18 because I'd want to put charms on it but like that's actually 14 karat gold in the heart so that's really nice so it's $169 for that one and that's also coming out 15th of April it definitely wasn't there in store anyway <laughs> it's very nice We just have the sliding bracelets. I don't think there's anything new there. I don't have any of the sliding bracelets. It's never really been something that I've been interested in. Okay, so these are the regular moment spangles don't think anything has changed there still would love to have one of these one of those but I don't know if that's going to happen anytime soon these are all the same still loving my two-tone open bangle This is new. Sparkling Hero Tennis Bracelet. So that might be nice. Very hard to tell from the picture what it really is. 
quite like all these bracelets. Now this is new and this should be quite interesting. To me it looks like the little links that they've got that rose necklace. Similar to what the Pandora Me bracelet is but different again. It looks like it's got a fancy clasp because it says rose petals link bracelet. So I'll be really interested to see this. It's great to actually get a catalogue that has some stuff that's not out yet. And there's the rose version. So that's the same as what the necklace is. But it's not saying it's new, so it must have already been out. I've just got a few of the leathers. They used to have lots of leathers and now they don't. Okay, these are safety chains, which I absolutely love my safety chains. Nothing new there. I do like this family tree one, it's really pretty. I may add that to my collection one day. And these are all the same. Okay, there's a lot to look at here. Okay, you've got angel wings and mum. So that's coming out for Mother's Day. This is a new one as well, Heart and Clover. Those ones all seem the same. Oh, this one here. This one looks really, really beautiful. I saw her on Art of Pandora. She's shown a few of these. It's really great to have somebody doing blogs and being able to look at the previews. It helps you to plan ahead. This one's new. Love Home Heart. Love what? Love My Home Heart. That's an interesting name. Still love this one. This one's really cool. Because it's got more than one page, so it's really good. It's not just like a card. Oh, this one's new. Glitter globe. That's a mum charm. I know I think it's England that's already had Mother's Day or going to have it very soon, so some of these have already been released overseas. This one's new. Coming out soon. It's a mum one as well. Like I said, nice to be able to plan ahead. This is also new. The two-tone one. I have quite a few of the rose and silver ones, don't they? This one here, this one here. Bring me out a lot for Mother's Day. Oh, this one's neat here. Love you, Infinity Heart. That's interesting. 
I don't have a lot of rose. I sort of didn't get into it that much because being plated, I didn't know how it would go on my skin. I haven't really had any problems with it. The only one I've had is one that had um, Parve CZs that the CZs for some reason actually weren't like a greeny blue color. But as far as the actual metal goes, it stayed really well. And I just either wash it in the the solution that Pandora sells or I do it in warm soapy water. This one's coming out. I think this will be quite nice. I love that Pandora is making more two-tone again. Actually 14 karat gold and silver. As long as they do them right, they will sell well I believe. And they seem to be quite well priced for the most part. This funny little car, little electric car, kind of looks a bit like a beetle. It's kind of cute. Pandora's also doing quite a few brightly coloured things. But in saying that, they're not doing a lot of Murano's anymore. This one's new, coming out. That's my little love coupon. They're all the same, nothing new there. These are all new. Like I said, the ones that say new are probably not out yet. They'll be coming out around Mother's Day for the collection then. So as far as I know, it's a club charm. Um, that's when they're all coming out. But it's good that we've already got the catalogue. This should be really nice. It's to match the bracelet that we saw. And this says you have a heart of gold and it is 14 carats so it will definitely be nice whereas this one here is Pandora Shine. Sorry. I did have a look at this world globe a little while ago and I don't feel that there's a lot of detail and definition in the gold but it is a big slab of gold so it depends what you're looking for in a charm but it is quite a nicely done charm. I just wish there was a little bit more detail in it. And Australia's not gold this time. And that's just the letters, but nothing new. There we go. And there's nothing new here. Sorry to rush through, but I'm sure you can pause it if um, I'm going too fast. Just want to try and focus on the stuff that is new. It's new rainbow. Don't see anything else new there. I think I'm sure I saw this at the shop the other day. Oh, this was definitely there. So 
So some of the new stuff might already be out and some of it's not. Of course some Mother's Day stuff wouldn't be out yet. Should have probably had a really good look at the book before I showed it to you but I didn't so <laughs> I might get a few things wrong. Australian birds that I have that charm. It's definitely different living here and the different noises and the different dogs barking. This has all come out in purple now. That's quite nice. It's all new. This is gorgeous. I've seen a few people do this video on beautiful glow in the dark firefly. A new concept, it's really cool. Since I only got given one book the other day, I have to re resist the urge to like come home and circle or cut out everything. Seen the same. But these ones are all new and they're at the store the other day. I love that they're bringing some more pet things out. These are really cute. Like the back of the dog and the cat have a little tail. They're really cute. This little here. Sort of see in the picture, it's not that clear. But they do have like a pearly sort of enamel. Oh, and this was really nice. It's um, it's really tastefully done actually. It's probably the nicest birthday charm I think they've done. Like you could wear this on any bracelet and you wouldn't get sick of it. And the wedding rings, I saw this the other day. And this. This is really, really, like there's not a lot of gold there. They're quite narrow, skinny glasses. Definitely champagne glasses, not wine glasses. But it's very, I found it quite difficult to see what it was. But then I don't have the greatest eyes either. This was new, I saw this at the store. It's actually really well done, the new artist palette. I've been wanting to get the old one, but I quite like the new one. Not sure if this is out yet. Possibly not. It's very cute. Now these are some more two tones. You got the frog prince. I've got to be honest, I thought he was a bit creepy, not quite as good as the well, I really like the old version of it. It's more serious looking. This is more character looking. 
This is a, quite a narrow charm. I do prefer the old version of that as well, but this I was very impressed at. Two-tone crown, very nice. This gold is on both sides. It's very, very nice. And I'm not sure what the two-tone gold castle, like I held on to it and the it sort of hangs forward a bit so I don't know that it's going to rub on the bale but I don't know they did a good job but at the same time because of the fact that they've actually had the loop thing short I don't know that I like how it hangs it would be interesting to see it on a, a bracelet These interesting, very vibrant. Not sure how I feel about them. Kind of like the oval lights in a way. Pretty colours though. I've seen some beautiful bracelets on Instagram. Pandora Shine, oh, that's 14 carat, that's still 14 carat, so they've got a couple of 14 carat and a couple of shine on this page. Still love this little sheet, so cute. This is new. Like I said, not many Muranos, but these ones are coming out, I believe. Or are they regular? These ones are going to be new. Sorry if my camera wobbles a little bit. I've got just a flimsy desk now that I'm set up here so until we get to something a bit more permanent in the new house um, it's just have to make do now I was having a discussion I'm pretty sure it was Karen from PR girl about whether these were Murano or not now I thought they were enamel and she was told they were Murano and we sort of had a bit of disc discussion about it but they actually say they're Murano so that'd be great because the white wouldn't actually go off, go funny, as sometimes it does. Yeah, I'll have to have another look at them because they're really pretty. You have to tell me if that wasn't you, Karen. These clips, oh, they are really, really pretty. Like really nice because they're really well oxidized underneath. I was actually quite tempted by them. And these are very similar. They're the old version that we had, the peach blossom, and that's a new one coming out. I'm not sure if it was out now or not. If you know the answers to any of the questions I ask, you can always tell me too. Because sometimes I go to the store and I just sort of look at what I want to look at. I don't necessarily Look at everything. Okay, I've got a couple of these rings. Quite nice. Been around for a while now. I 
I finally got a couple of the Regal Beauty rings. Gee, they're nice to wear. Really, really nice rings. And hopefully they'll go a little bit more oxidized, but gee, they're just really nice and they go with everything and they're a really good height. So many things I've missed out on showing you all because I haven't been doing videos as I get things, which is annoying. Oh, this is cute. Now, yeah, I don't think that's out yet or I would have seen it. Ooh, that'll be interesting to look at. Very nice. Sorry if this video is very long, guys, but kind of what it's like when you're trying to show a bit oh you know like a whole catalog you can always come back and finish it later I guess But how good is it that I've moved to a place that has Pandora stores? Even though I've managed to go quite country and I still have two Pandora stores. Look at this. This is really pretty. That is really pretty. Yeah, I don't think I saw that. So that must be still coming out. That's very, very nice. nice too. Very pretty. Sometimes it's hard to tell from the books what they actually are. And this, interested in this, another 14 karat two-tone ring. That should be really nice. Definitely 15th of April. Okay, so these are the matching earrings. They're really pretty. Have to wait and see in person, I guess. Some things you love in the book are not that great in person and other things you don't take much notice of. You absolutely love in real life, that's what I found anyway. seen this before. Lady Beetle and a Clover. Don't know if anyone else has seen that before. To me that would appear to be new but maybe out and I just haven't seen it. It's like the bee in the heart. It's super cute. See and now there's matching studs to that two-tone heart set. And I did see these. These are definitely out because I saw them. Okay, so the black new is not come out yet. And the pink new is out now. So sorry I didn't notice that before. It's very hard to tell when I'm looking at the camera. But the writing is slightly different in the book.
Okay, chains. So the only one that's new here is the Rollo chain, it's fairly new. The rest are the same. And this is a link chain necklace. But it is only 50 centimetres, so I probably wouldn't like that because 50 centimetres falls in a bad spot for me. So that'll be interesting to look at. See the rose version of that's 45 centimetres. Quite like that, but yeah I don't know that it would be my style with being rose and there's still a 14 karat gold necklace all the rest are the same okay now what have we got new here really love my O pendants. Now they're bringing out a new one. Heart style. So that'll be interesting. I guess that'll be really good for if you just want one pendant. Nothing new here. Now I bought this necklace the other day when they had the three for two sale and I ended up returning it and getting a voucher which when I went to the Pandora store the other day I used up my voucher but I found that this necklace if you want to wear it short like kind of almost choker length or a little bit longer it's sort of it doesn't sit right or well, didn't for me because I can't be fiddling around with my arms and my you know around my neck and that all the time so in because this heart bit doesn't actually slide up and down the chain when you slide the thing to shorten the chain it ends up that the other part of the chain ends up right around so I found that it constantly wanting to spin down around my neck so it was never sitting in the right spot. So it may suit some people and it is really really pretty but keep that in mind that because they didn't make it be able to slide up and down because I do have the little B one that's like a little honeycomb shape, a hexagon and it slides up and down the chain and I don't have any problems with that at all. Okay, so this is the Rose Flower Petals necklace. So it'd be interesting to see what this one's like as well. It's a 45 centimeters, so it may adjust differently. Yeah, it was different. I was a bit disappointed because I did want that whole set. And um, I don't know whether the Daisy one does it too might be different having the little clip in bits because I really like that daisy one if anyone's got this daisy one can they tell me what the end of it's like and whether it moves in an annoying way I don't know maybe it's just me this is going to be new Nothing new there. That necklace has been around for so long, but now they've added this one. See, this one could be the same. I can't wait to see what the end of that's like. It's really cute. I really like that one. And I did see this one. 
that matches the earrings. It's not big and it's not small so you can wear it high or low and it sort of has like cut out bits. It's quite interesting actually. It's very different. Somebody was saying the other day that the other honeycomb dangle, well, the beehive dangle, the tiger's eye was out of stock. Now it's not in this book, so I'm not sure if it's with the charms or whether it's actually gone from Australia or not. I have that one, so I'm happy to have it. Okay, we have Panda and me. I must say the difference in the price to what these were when they first came out so glad I got mine when I did and thank you to all those other youtubers that actually said oh they're going up in price because I got I paid $15 for the bumblebees and $9 for these spaces and the jump. I couldn't have done that bee bracelet that I did. It would have just cost me way too much. They're cute. I don't mind that Pandora me. The sun one's cute. They're all the same. Okay, reflections. Now I know this one's fairly new. This is definitely new, I haven't seen this before. So that's a pink one, 4th of March. Yeah, so this one came out the other day. Safety chains. Don't think there's anything new. Oh yeah, these ones are new. They've just come out, I believe. Okay, so pink ones. Harry Potter collection. There's a bangle. So just wondering, do you guys still get catalogues? Have you got the new catalog? Does Pandora post them out when you can't get into store if you order online? I really think there should be a box that you can tick if you order online and say that you want the catalogue because they always offer us you know do you want a bag like a gift bag or something but you can't always ask if you want the catalogue and if you're not getting into store it's really really hard to actually get it I really like this this is really pretty this is new this just came out I didn't end up looking at that. I'm not really into Alice in Wonderland or that sort of thing, but I must say that Pandora Addict made me think, hmm, there's a couple of charms that are really, really nice. And I looked at them in store and they were really nice. <laughs> okay, so I haven't really looked at these. This is coming out. This is a Disney Simba. Oh, he's so cute. 
Oh, I can't wait to see him. Looks kind of a bit creepy on the screen. I don't know how well he's showing up, but I can see the little details on his face and he is quite cute. And look, another Disney Dumbo. Oh, that's so cute. That one's actually really cute. And this is also really cute. Disney Lady. Oh, so they've got some new ones of these coming out. Little Disney friends. They're so cute. I do like some of these. Mickey and Minnie Anniversary. I will always love you. That's interesting. That might be interesting to look at. It's not out yet though. Yeah, these ones here. This one here and this one here are really well done. I really do like this little guy. This is new, a new Lilo and Stitch. It's hard to tell from that. Oh, hello. Happy Bee Birthday. A oh, Winnie the Pooh. You see that? That's Winnie the Pooh. Really miss that. And there's another Disney Dumbo. Is there another Disney Dumbo movie or something coming out? Did I miss something? I feel like there's a few Dumbo charms. Nothing new there. Does anyone else think it's weird that there's literally, what, one dress left? I really like her though. She's really cute. Kind of wish the pictures were a little bit bigger so I could see better. Oh, that or I need to go back to the optometrist. <laughs> We've moved now. I have to find a new one. Okay, Star Wars. Nearly there, guys. Nearly at the end. Hopefully you've managed to stay with me. They're all the same ones. And I think that's it. Yep, that's it. It's done. Wow, that was um, quite a big book actually. Well, I won't keep you any longer, but thank you for joining me and I hope you enjoyed having a flick through of the catalogues and my thoughts about it all. And um, the next video I'll be showing you is the few things I picked up in the Pandora store the other day when I picked up the catalog. Until next time, take care.